Hey guys, so the time is here and we're about to leave for our Disney vacation. We're so excited mm -hmm. and we thought we would get on here and kind of show you what we're going to pack for our vacation. Yeah. So without further ado, let's do it. Okay, so I'm going to go through and show you guys everything I'm packing. Justin will go through his and just kind of our clothes category and hats then we'll hit like the toiletry area and then we'll show you guys what we're packing it in and how we're packing it so those are kind of the three different categories we'll be encompassing so first i'll show you guys oh, the clothes i'm packing some of you guys might think this is boring but i love watching packing videos and i like seeing what people pack i don't know i'm weird so hopefully you guys like this but here's my shirts I didn't realize how much I like gray until I saw a lot of them out and all the gray here. But I've got my Star Wars Galaxy's Edge shirt. I actually got this at a Disney outlet this summer. So I was really excited. It was like 10 bucks. And I was like, cool, I'll wear that when we go to Galaxy's Edge. And I've got just, um, just a light t-shirt with Mickey on it. Um, this is actually a Walt Disney World shirt. Some of these my sister let me borrow, so thank you to my sister. And then I've got this tank with Steamboat Willie, super cute. And then an up tank top, it's just got like the whole up balloons on there. And then my Wally and Eve shirt, got that at Kohl's. And this um, Mickey Mouse one, I love the different Mickeys there, got that one at Kohl's as well. This is another one my sister let me borrow. I think this is super cool for Disneyland, very fitting. It's got Walt on there, so that's pretty cool. I don't really see a lot of shirts with good old Walt Disney. So. Good old Mr. Walt. Yes. And then this is another one of my sisters. She gave me to borrow with Ariel, but who cares? Uh, no big deal. Uh, <laughs> Yeah. Definitely off key. <laughs> this is actually one of this and is one of my favorites. I don't know why. Really? It's, just it just the Walt Disney. Oh, I think the reason why I like that is because it just literally like brings me back to I, like childhood, like when all the, the movie movies. Started. Yeah, I don't yeah. know. Because when, whenever we would too. go to Disneyland vacations, when I was you know raised or whatever, we would always watch so many Disney movies before we go. So yeah. I think that just kind of gets bring. It's just nostalgic yeah. for me. It is cool. So I got some tank tops and t-shirts there. Um, it does get chilly in the evening, so I've got two sweatshirts here. Um, I'm really excited. It'll be my first time wearing this in the Disneyland park, but um, I have my Disneyland Spirit jersey with the D here, so I'm excited about that. And then I've got this one a sweet friend got for me. It's super retro, like um, Mickey, so and it's light, but it's also cozy. Thank you, Dana, so I'll be wearing that too. <laughs> then I just have shorts. And then I'll probably bring like two oh, three pairs a, of pants. And there's a Boston. Boston sleeping. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> Look at his beard. It's all matted. Yeah. Hey. Away from the boys doing something to him. <laughs> and then I've got my two pairs of ears in here. I got this little um, handy dandy thing um, from a giveaway from um, Leg Life's channel. It's perfect for your ears. And I've got some other small ones you guys will be seeing with my toiletries in it. Then I've got my jammies, of course they're Disney, uh, Lion King hat, and my Dole Whip ears, and a belt. So, I'll show you guys that. <laughs> they, I need to wash some of these things, it's a little wrinkly. But it says, if you can dream if it, you can, can dream it, you, you can, can do, do it. it. Walt Disney. Wow. So, that's pretty much everything I'm bringing as far as clothes go. Like, obviously, I've got, like, like socks and all of that. Um, Socks and all of that. Uh, yeah. I wonder what the all of that is. Undergarments. <laughs> Kids are watching this channel in my bag too, but I won't show you that. So, there you go. Hey, what's up guys? Okay, so this is my stuff. Um, so, we'll start right off the bat with the Lion King. Uh, I got this Lion King shirt, which is pretty cool. And it's all the rave right now, obviously. <laughs> um, so I picked that out. Lacey picked it out. 
Pretty much all your shirts. I Pretty think. much all my shirts. <laughs> um, she, actually, she got some really good deals. Um, and so, I'll, honestly, a lot of my shirts I'm rocking is they're like new. I haven't even worn them yet. So, and this is uh, probably one of my favorite shirts Lacey got, but it's kind of like the animation kind of look of Mickey, um, which I really, really like. So that's kind of a classic Mickey shirt. Uh, I got Star Wars shirt for Galaxy Edge, um, which yeah. It's classic Star Wars. I want to find an actual Galaxy Edge shirt while yes. I'm there, but I thought this would be great, so that way I'm actually wearing a shirt, and I'll find a shirt, and I'll put that shirt on, and I'll ditch this shirt in some kind of trash can. Mm -hmm. That's the plan, not really. Mm -hmm. And then I have uh, this Buzz and Woody 95 is when it came out. Mm -hmm. uh, Marvel for DCA, um, and uh, yeah, just, just a classic Marvel shirt. Uh, this is probably one of my favorite shirts, though, and it has its, um, yeah, Neverland, Neverland map. So it has, like, really cool. Mermaid Lagoon, Lost Boys Hideout. Um, I, I love this shirt. I got this in San Francisco at the Disney store there. Um, I do have this shirt right here, which is a long sleeve for those either cooler mornings or cooler nights, but it has a Mickey logo right here. And on the back, it kind of sports out its 90th anniversary right there. Cool. Got um, that H&M, right? Got an H&M. And then it's cool because it has, like, all, like, the, you know, Mickey with the balloons and stuff on the sleeves and everything right here, which I like a lot, a lot too. Then I have this, which is actually, I love this sweatshirt. I got this at Target. Mm -hmm. um, but it's cool because it's a sweatshirt, but it's short sleeve, which... Kind of 80s. It's kind of 80s, and I really <laughs> like it. It's super cozy for mornings or evenings or just around the hotel hanging out um, pretty jacked about that and this is the only hoodie that I'm bringing because I hope to find a Disneyland hoodie or sweatshirt or something like that in the park also as far as my hats go I have this guy right here which is a pretty cool hat from H&M with the ears and everything like that these are my my only ears I'm bringing um, because I'm just not an ear kind of person <laughs> <laughs> but I'll probably get sucked into something and I'll have to buy it because I get weird with souvenirs in Disneyland. Yes. It's a weird thing. Uh, vacation mode, I'll probably rock this when we are traveling. Um, has a Disney castle on there. I love this hat. And also I'll rock this one too. And again, that's the only hats I'm bringing because I hope to find another hat in Disneyland. Also, this right here, which is just a, a North Face jacket that I'll actually keep in my backpack in the park as well. Um, speaking of that, we actually did a video talking about all the stuff that we're going to be putting in our backpack for like our, our day pack. Um, and so we'll actually link that above and also below too. Um, I'll probably wear just a couple pairs of shorts, a couple pairs of pants um, for the park and that's that's pretty much it. Okay, so now for the gear. I'm going to make this really fast because we already did kind of what we're kind of bringing for the park but uh we actually have our business cards right here just in case people are like what are you doing we'll be like hey we're we're vlogging stuff um this is kind of like a usb hub to charge all our stuff in the hotel room um this is a light for those dark nights when we're vlogging osmo for our phone it's a gimbal um this bag right here which will keep our gopro in um so that way we can just grab this for the pool or something like that um and then we'll pretty much put our all of our camera gear in this low pro bag right here and then this will be stored in our bag um, for the day then we got beats right here um, for the airplane airpods um, one thing I really wanted to pause and talk about though is we talked about this on our day pack video but this is called a fuel rod um, this is what I'll actually take it out of here but it comes with it's, it's basically looks like a Mentos like mm -hmm. package but it's so a battery it, and you can, it looks like a big battery to me <laughs> oh yeah maybe it's it a battery for some reason it looks like mentos but it does or look that. a big battery <laughs> um but basically this is just to charge your phone the great thing about this though is that um they have a vending machine inside the park and when this is dead you just pop this whole thing inside the vending machine and it pops out a brand new one that's charged um, it's about $30 in the park. You can actually get it for $20 if you order ahead of time, plus $5 shipping, so you're saving about five bucks. Um, but the great thing is, is they have these all over the place when you're traveling. They have them in um, airports and things like that. So, um, so yeah, this is, I'm excited to try it out. 
So now for the toiletry section. Um, I've got, like I shared with you guys, smaller versions of the bags you saw with my ears. So this will carry just like my face wash, deodorant, hairspray, um, dry shampoo, gotta have that, and my brushes. Got face lotion, toothpaste, face towels, and then I'll get my toothbrush in there before we leave. And then this is super cool. I use this for traveling um, for my hot tools. Um, it's nice because when they're hot, you can put them in here. So the morning before we fly off, if I'm using it and it's still warm, um, you could just throw them in here and it protects it. So I love this for traveling with flat irons and curling irons. And then my makeup, I got in my little bow pack. Um, we found these at Target in the school supply section. They were pencil bags, but I thought this would be a super pencil cute. Pencil bag, I mean, come on. <laughs> you can put your pencils in there. Yeah, but, but it's way cooler to put GoPros and makeup. Makeup. So I there. got like my makeup going on in there. And yeah, I'll just add in like a few last minute things before we leave that I'm using. Um, but that's pretty much my toiletry area. And then my toiletry stuff is similar shampoo all that kind of fun stuff but something i wanted to point out is i take these guys whenever i travel anywhere um first off is it's jack black made by jack black but it's um just a moisturizer like face um especially going to different places um keeps my face nice and smooth um and also it has Say that again. <laughs> nice and smooth um <laughs> I don't know where that came from. It's late, guys. To be it's honest, really like we, to be honest, like we started filming this probably like three hours ago. Tucker threw up. Um, there's just been like one thing after another going on. So hopefully this all makes sense. I don't know, but we're getting through it. Yeah. That's all that matters. But anyway, it has um, 20 SPF, so that way my my face doesn't burn. Mm -hmm. um, and then also I have this. It's called Face Buff. So. The thing we do with the parks is we'll go in the mornings, we'll hang out for like several hours and about two or three, we'll go back to the hotel, kind of rest. I'll put this stuff on and it just kind of wakes up your face mm. and you're kind of refreshed, ready to go for the evening time. So these are my essential carries I always take on vacation and they're, they're the best. I highly recommend them. Like if you're a girl too, I don't know. Girls Thank wear this you. stuff, right? Okay, fine. <laughs> but do it. Okay. They're brilliant. The last category, all of this is going to go inside these. So this is my bag. I love my Mickey Mouse suitcase. It has traveled across seas and a lot of other places, so it's gotten a little worn. <laughs> but it's really big. I'll show you guys inside. So as you can see, pretty big to fit everything in there. It's nice. It's got these big pockets for like shoes and stuff and zipper. So this is my suitcase. And then this is my park bag. Um, you can see our video about that, of everything I keep in there. And then these are packing cubes. So um, everything you see right here is in this, right here, but it's pink. Obviously this one's mine, and Justin has a gray one. But these are super cool. Uh, we got these for Justin before he went to Romania, and it packed all of his clothes yeah. so well. It just um, kind of makes everything in your suitcase more compact, I guess, and just gives you more room. I, I've been to Romania several times, but this is the first time I actually still had tons of room in my suitcase, and it was all because of these packing I'm using cubes. These. Yeah. yeah, and we'll, we'll put a link down below from the from where we got it from Amazon. Yeah. But they yeah they just smash everything together, but they don't it doesn't wrinkle anything. No. It just yeah. puts them all together and just it just organizes it better. Right. And it just can, compresses it. Yeah, because you can keep yeah. your shirts in one, your pants in one, um, underwear. In and it's one, nice, like when you get yeah, and when you get to the hotel or whatever. Um, you can just take these things out separately and then you have them all organized and you're not yeah. like digging in your suitcase and messing everything up too. Right. And then behind me here is Justin's suitcase. So he's got this big North Face one. And then nice. also this is my bag that I'm taking in the park as well. Um, which again, you guys should definitely check out our day pack video if you have not seen that yet. All right, guys, well, that is our packing video. Hopefully, it all made sense. Again, it's super late, and <laughs> everything just went wrong. But the good news is, is we're, like, we're already, like, packed, and we still have, you know, a few more days left, so I feel good. Mm -hmm. It's going to be a really busy few days, so. But this is the thing. If we've missed anything, 
okay please let us know in the description below some things that you need in disneyland or you pack because we still have a few days and we can still go get it and all that kind of good stuff so let us know but hopefully you guys enjoyed this and uh if you like this video like it um subscribe if you haven't subscribed and ring that little bell uh because that way it lets you know when we put out a new vlog and we also we put out vlogs every single tuesday at 7 a.m our next vlog guys will be inside the park so tune into that down below has our instagram handles um, we're gonna be posting a lot of information a lot of just pictures and insta stories all that kind of stuff mm -hmm. um on our z roll account we have our personal stuff down there as well but mainly we're gonna be posting a lot of stuff on that z roll account so like us follow us do all that good stuff we want to connect with you guys there um but anyway we love you guys and thank you for hanging out i'll see you guys next week yeah see you guys in the park yeah later guys